folks, and welcome to In the Kitchen with Pete. Today, we're doing a crunchy, garlicky, spicy shrimp. They're outstanding, great for an appetizer, great for a main. You're going to love it. Let's get to it. Let's put together our dry spice mixture. Excellent on many different types of seafood. Just keep it in an airtight container. Okay, we're going to start off with a half a teaspoon of paprika and a half a teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of Old Bay seasoning. Our last item, a quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper will not make it too spicy. You can always add more. Mix it up well. This seasoning will cover 8 to 10 raw extra large shrimp. I've cleaned them, peeled, but I left the tails on. Squeeze the juice out of a half of a lime all over the shrimp and then give it a good mix. Add our spice mixture, give it a good stir and place that in the fridge for at least 20 minutes. Now what I'm doing here is adding some cornstarch, at least a tablespoon and a half. Using a small strainer, I'm just going to dust that shrimp and that's what's going to give me that nice crispiness that I'm looking for. On a medium to a high heat, I'm going to add one tablespoon of butter and one tablespoon of olive oil. Now I'm going to need two large cloves of garlic, finely diced. These are large cloves, so if you're using small cloves, maybe three or four. Add the shrimp. They only take about a minute and a half on each side. It's golden brown and looking crispy. It's time to give it a flip. Now it's endless with the different types of sauces you could use with this shrimp dish. I'll show you my quick go-to sweet chili sauce. You can find that in any grocery store near the Asian food items. It's quick, it's delicious, and goes really nice with this shrimp. Well, I'm so excited to give these a try. Oh man. They look delicious. You can tell they're already going to be crunchy. Oh man. Wow. You got to serve these up for some friends, family. A little crunch, a little spicy, and that. A little bit of uh, chili sweet sauce is a nice little dipper for it. You're going to love it. Well, thanks for coming out and watching In the Kitchen with Pete. Until next time, see ya!